Oh, don't do it. Don't pull in front of me. Uh, we're trying to escape the highway. Oh, oh. Oh, we have uh, lost. Uh, hopefully the family wasn't in the back. Yeah, we lost the caravan. And, uh, so we're going to try to just take down somebody. Oh, my goodness. That was not what I meant when I said take down somebody. Okay, well, I feel like we're going a little too fast. Uh, oh, this is fine. Uh, we've got a big bumper. Oh, we just broke an axle. Oh, we lost a tire. Um... So today we're going to be checking out a new mod that adds some really awesome gigantic trucks to the game. Now what's neat about this model, it's years 87 through 2006. But yeah, there's a ton of cool variations to this. Uh, you've got police variations. You've got like a, it looks like a tow truck. We'll go over them here in a second, but I had to grab this American looking one. We're here in Johnson Valley and I really want to put it through its paces real quick. Uh, before we try towing some vehicles and maybe doing some police chases. I mean, this probably isn't the wisest thing that we uh, are going to choose to do here. Uh, I'm not sure this is really supposed to be an off-roader, but we're doing it anyways until it falls apart. Oh my goodness. All right. I'm not sure this thing's going to be capable of jumping a dune. And oh, we're bogging down a little bit. I think I broke something in the right front. The wheel is wobbling. Uh, it's like a stress test, but it's actually going fairly well. Oh, man, she might be sucking up sand here. Oh, <laughs> oh there goes the wheel. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, I think this definitely was not quite meant for uh, what we're doing. But let's head over to the gas station and test it out on the road. So, yeah, here it is. Uh, it's got a ton of cool configurations. And there's a skin pack, which adds a ton of amazing skins. They're all kind of loosely based off of real companies. But yeah, you got like U-Haul uh, looking ones. Uh, there's actual flatbed ones. You got several rowbacks, which is awesome to see. And there's even a ram plow. Also, did I mention the whole fact that there are several police variants too that we're going to test out? So down here towards the bottom, there's a C45 turbo pickup, which by the way, once you uh, go and read the mod description on the BeamNG website, uh, there's a more detailed description as far as like the different models and the years and uh honestly it's a really good uh write-up and really detailed lore about the mod dude this is a really cool version i like the uh the toolboxes in the back uh hold on let me let off a little bit oh you can hear the turbo that's cool what's the interior the interior is actually pretty nice on this definitely an older style interior obviously the mod ends in 2006 uh but i'm not sure i need to double check what year this one would be uh, like I said, they're actually broke down on the uh, the website. I also love the fact this says Merc on it. And it's got a tow hitch on it. So uh, definitely would be a very capable tower, which we should obviously test that. But hold on, let's test the crashes. <laughs> oh my goodness. We have a uh, we have a new passenger in the car. It is, uh, it's a pole. All right, we got ourselves a fully loaded camper here. I don't know if the, uh, does it actually on? Oh, oh, I could fuel over here. I didn't realize that. Hold on, let's go ahead and fuel. I haven't done this on video yet. Uh, so yeah, that's what feeling's like in beam and G. I wonder if you're uh, a little more on empty. Does it take longer to fill up? Okay, let's connect these two. Boom. Oh my goodness. Uh, that's a bit overkill. Also, I know there's an extended caravan mod, but do we have anything a little bit more modern than this caravan? This caravan looks like it's probably from the 60s or 70s. That'd be a mod idea and a half. I'd love to see like a modern version of this. Uh, we're going to pull over. We're going to turn off some traffic here. I'd love to deal with that. Also, that's got to be very unpleasant in the back. Holy man. Okay, we're getting back on the road. I've already made the... I didn't do anything. I'm just driving around with my, uh, my little caravan here. What? Okay, the cops are angry at me. Yeah, Johnson Valley isn't the best for police chases, considering there's only like one road that most cars can use. I mean, if you're in a like a, a dune buggy or something, uh, this map is for you. Also, I like how the uh, traffic's using the uh, parallel road to the right. Like, are they going to the big competition over there? Oh, there's a Chantilla in front of us. Oh no, I probably should not have taken this. Okay. <laughs> it's a really rough ride for the people in the back. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, don't do it. Don't pull in front of me. Uh, we're trying to escape the highway. Oh, oh. Well, we have uh, lost. Uh, hopefully the family wasn't in the back. Yeah, we lost the caravan. And oh, I broke off the back tire. Uh, the dually is gone. And oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, it didn't break off. It's still. Wait, how's it hanging on? <laughs> I don't know how we're still going. Oh, I hear the cops. Are they, uh, are they taking this road? Oh, they're on the main road. I'm sure they'll turn off. Oh, engine starved of oil. Uh-oh. Uh, all right, we have really, really screwed this up. Uh, oh, on, turn it around, turn it around. Okay, oh, they're coming down the road. 
I, I kind of want to crash into him head on, but I, I feel like we're not going fast enough to do damage. Oh, <laughs> never mind. You know, I think with a truck this size, you don't have to go very fast to cause uh, some damage. Uh, what do you say we go to a map with a little more uh, actual asphalt? So, yeah, as they go up in number, it seems like the C-75 might be the uh, the biggest version of this. Hold on, let's pull out this one. Oh, my goodness. That's big. Uh, <laughs> we can run over some stuff with this. By the way, it is fully functional. Uh, this opens up. So you can stuff things back there. All right, let's get moving. Oh, she's a, this is a chunky boy right here. Hold on, what's the interior look like on this one? This is a nice, cozy cab. I, I like this a lot, actually. Oh, the gear shifter does work. Should probably pay attention to the road and what I'm uh, about to run over. Like, I would probably rather use, like, the rollback version of this opposed to even just the normal D series. I, I like the extra power. I like the beefiness. Oh, yeah, this is good. It's got a lot of pickup. I mean, this is a runaway truck. You know we had to do a runaway truck challenge. This is, like, the perfect road for it. Just shut the engine off and get rid of the brakes and just see if we can maneuver down against the cops. Oh, wow. Dude, how did we save that? That was amazing. Okay. Um... Yeah, you know, I'm actually going to do that. I'm going to go to the top here in a second. I'm going to shut the... Oh, yeah, uh, when you get a big... Oh, dude, the guardrail went through the, uh, the box part. Wow. Yeah, when you get a big truck like... Yep, that spawn point's great. Yeah, when you get a big truck like this, of course, you got to try not to tip over. Oh, that was the most aggressive... What is wrong with the police today? Dude, it went right for the back wheels. That was an aggressive takedown. Okay, they're still chasing me. Uh, okay, watch out. You gotta watch for the wheels on this thing. Oh, they're flying up. I love the new bloom effect. Like, seeing the way the lights, uh, especially on the, uh, police cars, react to the road. Like, everything just looks so much more poppy now. Okay, we're gonna say this is a runaway tr- Oh, my- Oh, yep, that didn't last very long. <laughs> Trying to avoid the cop there. Okay, we're gonna let the cops have their day here. Uh, they really want to pull me over. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna remove the brakes on this. So we'll make it a runaway truck. Okay, she officially has no brakes on it now. The cops are still, what is going on here? It, it's over, you guys won. You you won the fight. All right, here we go. I got ticketed for police collision. Technically, I think they ran into me. All right, hold on, let's test it. Okay, brake lights, they turn on, but I am holding it down and it is rolling, so. Hey, you're a trucker going down, you know. The brakes haven't gone out yet. But, wait, they're pursuing me for what? I haven't even done anything. I feel like it's just illegal to drive the truck. Oh, my goodness. Okay, not having brakes on this. Dude, I'm not even hitting the... Okay, hold on. Slide it, slide it, slide it. Oh, okay. Definitely need to put on one of the big bumpers on this. But, man. Okay, this isn't too bad. Yeah, we ought to do this more often. I, I want to try this. Maybe there's some uh, better maps to do this with. I like this road. But I feel like there's other, like, downhill sections that'd be fun uh, for, like, a runaway truck challenge. And, oh, no, 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 no. Turn, turn, turn. Okay, just use the wall. Okay, gas it up. The cops are after me. Oh, dude, the left front is broken. Uh, oh, are we going to be good? No, it's just I can't get it to not do that. <laughs> yeah, it was, like, permanently stuck to the left. At least the uh, left front was. And we have destroyed... Uh, the truck. So I might have to find a different map for the runaway challenge. So you can hear my vehicle rolling in the background. I was just checking out all the rollbacks. So the C55 has a rollback. And of course, you got some basic flatbeds. There's some rollbacks up towards the top too. There is like so much to check out in this mod. It's kind of hard to cover it all in one video. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and go with, you know, let's go with a little bit bigger one. Dude, that is so good looking. Uh, I like this. We got the uh, extended cab there, so for whoever you're towing, they can ride in the back and in comfort. A uh, very, very roomy interior. Uh, so let's go ahead. How about we load something up here? So let's pull this up here. I hope the cops aren't still after me. Like, I haven't done anything. All right, so let's go here. Okay, bed's coming back. We got to find something to tow here. Uh, we're going to say our dune kicker here needs a little work. Uh, I did not put that bed all the way down. Thankfully, this thing is ginormous uh, and has big tires. Can I even fit on this? Uh, barely. Yeah, I wish we had a nice, like, locking system or winch system. You know, it'd be kind of cool if the rollbacks at least had, like, maybe some sort of, like, hook or something that would kind of go around the tires. The one thing I really wish we had in beam, I know you could just do the nodes, which, you know, that's always a solution, too, but... Uh, I think there'd be other ways to do this. All right, so let's go ahead and... Oh, my goodness. This is going to be 
A bit of a chunky boy, but I think we got this. Oh, hold on. That's the legs. Okay, bed's coming up. Oh, it works really, really well. Actually, I just now realized we have the controls there. Oh, yeah, the controls, uh, you can work them, say, if you're just using the, uh, the first person mode. Okay, all the way to the front. Very, very nice. Uh, that was a nice load up. I mean, too bad it's going to fall off. Hold on, maybe I should uh, at least lock one or two of the nodes and see if we can keep this thing on. Yeah, this bad boy is definitely going to be able to handle it. Of course, you got also your little light bar here. Let people know you're coming. I mean, I think you're really supposed to just turn those on when you're uh, loading it up, say you're on the side of the road. Uh, we're going to keep it on anyways. I like how the cops are after... I didn't even do... What is the speed limit on this road? Is it like 20? Uh, okay. We just got to carefully get down here. This looks cool, by the way. Definitely changed the way the characteristics are as far as the handling, but it's fairly secure. I actually node grabbed like each tire and even one of the axles. So it's like it's a secured load, but I feel like... Oh my goodness, the cops are here. Okay, well, I feel like we're going a little too fast. Uh, oh, this is fine. Uh, we've got a big bumper. Oh, we just broke an axle. Oh, we lost a tire. Um, we probably need that, don't we? Okay, move out the way. I don't have time for this. I got to at least get the load uh, taken care of. I mean, we could disconnect all the nodes and take off in the the dune kick. You know what? Let's just drive up this way. I'll never catch us here. Yay! <laughs> oh, wait, I feel like we're... Hold on, can I drive it forward any? I feel like we're elevated enough. We could probably get the, uh, the dune kicker off the back and run. And Is that cop really... He busted me in the water. Really? So did you guys want a chunky police truck? This is honestly glorious looking. Uh, I like this a lot. It would be nice if there was uh, maybe a couple lights on the front. Uh, but man. Oh, the bumper lights. That looks cool. Oh, yeah. You know what? We got to bomb this hill real quick. Watch out. Let's see if some of the suspects will run from us. But oh, this is good. Wait, I think we need to be a street over. We need it to be even steeper. And, oh, watch out! And oh, <laughs> I just hip checked traffic there. Not sure this thing's gonna have the speed, but as far as the actual takedown power, look at that bumper. That is a big boy there. Okay, so we are here to protect and serve. Oh, the suspect's under arrest. Uh, we'll wait for the next one to run. I just want to bomb this hill. Man, this is so unnecessary, but it is so cool. Also, it takes the bumps uh, with ease. Oh, yes. Uh, oh, okay. We might want to sl oh, slow down. We I think we blew out the back window. Oh, okay. We're just going to use the pier here to help us slow down. Oh, <laughs> it takes a little bit to get this thing locked down. Okay, so Komodo might have just set everybody to flee because I got tired of waiting for a suspect car. So we're going to try to just take down somebody. Oh, my goodness. That was not what I meant when I said take down somebody. I think that was an innocent person. Okay, here we go. So say... Uh, this is our suspect up here. Was our suspect. Um, setting everybody to flee probably wasn't a good idea. I got tired of waiting for like somebody to take off on me. All right, so we're going to say... Oh, geez. Here's the takedown here. Oh, my goodness. I don't think you could safely ram somebody in this. I mean, you could probably do a decent pit maneuver, but definitely if you had a suspect that you needed to take down immediately, say it was like a very, very big danger... Doing a head-on collision with this actually is not out of the question. I just keep going. The bumper absorbs everything. And what's so good about the truck, like, say you need to cross onto the highway, just go off-roading. It's fine. You can just hop right on the highway, and you are good to go to continue the pursuit. I'm sorry. This is just such a lovely vehicle to drive and uh, take down. Oh, look at the traffic up there. I'm going to take down somebody. All right. We got somebody that's kind of by themselves. Oh, the cops are running, too. Yeah, this is kind of awkward, isn't it? All right, wait for it, wait for it. Boom! Oh, okay. Uh, it actually absorbed that hit. Hold on, let's try uh, clipping it. Oh, pit maneuvers. Oh, oh, whoops. <laughs> that was a glorious pit maneuver. Oh, you're screwed. Oh! <laughs> oh, it is, it's awesome. Yeah, if you guys want to check this out, it'll be linked down in the description. We'll see you guys next time.